Uh, but today, you said no snow right now. No snow right now. No we rain. do have a little bit uh, through the overnight, but if you take a look at the satellite and radar here, you can see a lot of it starting to wind down. But as we get you into this afternoon, we are going to be uh, tracking another chance for some of the mountain snow, lower elevation rainfall for us. So we'll talk about that, kind of break it down for you. But here's a look outside this morning. Dark but cold skies, not as chilly as yesterday. 33 degrees, winds east at around 5 miles an hour. And as we take you around the state, you can see a lot of us are looking at improvement. We do still have some single digits up in tone, but a lot of us are going to see the numbers climb, not just this morning, but into the afternoon as well. But do keep in mind, some light winds are making it feel chillier out there. So wind chill values still single digits for the north and east. That's definitely the coldest spot of the state, but 29 in Santa Fe and Albuquerque. It feels as though it's 29 due to that light wind that we do have and Socorro, a wind chill of 25 degrees. But the setup for today is we do have this disturbance. It's going to slide right across northern parts of the state now through tomorrow. That's going to bring us some mountain snow and it could bring us some low elevation rain. Southern half of the state really just going to be looking for increasing cloud cover and pretty mild temperatures. Much improvement from what we had yesterday uh, when we talk about the temperatures. But here's super storm track. I'm stopping it just after six o'clock. You can see where we get the shades of blue. That's where we have the snowfall, but we get you at lower elevations. We do have a few of those scattered showers, so kind of a wintry mix as you go up in elevation uh, as we get you up into our northern mountains. So that's something we will be watching through the afternoon and the evening. And we do have a winter weather advisory up in that location due to the possibility of some of that snow and also the transition from rain into snow. You get kind of that freezing mix, so we'll watch for that. But as we talk about uh, some of the snow we were just mentioning, the ski slopes, you can see some locations getting one to three inches. A few areas could get at our highest peak over three inches of snowfall. We could get up to about six inches of snow in some locations. At least that's what models are indicating for us. But here in Albuquerque, we are going to stay dry today, partly to mostly cloudy skies, increasing clouds, and the temperatures, they're going to be mild. We'll have the 50s later this afternoon, 56 for a high today in Albuquerque, 52 in Las Vegas, and we've got some 40s as we get to Tucumcari and Clovis. So finally breaking out of the below freezing temperatures for the northeast and east. By tomorrow, still tracking some of that mountain snow, southern tier. It's actually going to be pretty mild. Some locations flirting with 70 degrees. And then we get another blast of that cold weather as we make our way towards Sunday. We'll see those numbers drop pretty significantly. So southern Colorado, we do have the chance for the rain and snow mix. Again, higher elevations. That's where we'll have the snow possibility today. In the north and west, scattered showers through Farmington, Cuba, Dulce, even Chinle. Gallup today, a high of about 56 degrees. Into the south and west, pretty mild. Lots of mid-60s, 67 in Glenwood, 65 in TRC. Then into the south and east, not as chilly as we have been experiencing. 43 in Fort Sumner, 46 in Roswell, and 49 degrees in Artesia. Still cold, still jacket weather. Then by tomorrow, we'll have upper 60s and some 70s. In the northeast, increasing cloud cover with 40s and 50s today. 51 in Mora, 52 degrees in Las Vegas. Sunday, we could get some snow with that next front and a big drop by the end of the weekend. The northern mountains looking for high elevation snow, low elevation rainfall. 53 in Española and 49 degrees in Santa Fe. And then again by Sunday, we could see another round of some mountain snow with that next front moving in. The East Mountains, we have a good chance for the mountain snow by Sunday, but today just increasing clouds and mild. We'll have those 50s, 54 in Cedar Crest, 55 in Edgewood, and 55 degrees in Moriarty. And then the metro area, partly cloudy and mild today, 57 in the South Valley, 58 degrees in downtown, and 56 in Rio Rancho. And as we get you into the seven-day forecast, tomorrow our temperatures climb a little bit more, 59 degrees, lots of sunshine. Then Sunday, we do have that big drop in temperatures. If any of the moisture holds as it moves over the Sandias, a lot of it's going to fall on the east side of the mountains. But if it does move here, our temperatures will be warm enough that it should fall in the form of rain. But we're going to watch that closely as we get you towards the end of the weekend. Just stay inside Sunday, watch some football, right, kick your feet up, Sunday. grab a blanket, grab some hot chocolate.